We are in the land of Lincoln, Illinois. Look at this crowd. It never ceases to amaze me. All the people showing up, all the people growing amazing things, doing amazing things. Look at this diversity here. Okay, let's go. We're going to try something different. We're going to move the people clockwise, really, because I don't want to go film over there in this, this backlit situation so you can't barely even see his you face see anything, can you, see yeah. his, you can kind of see his face but look at this this is isn't this so much better lighting okay all right we'll start with y'all what's your name where are you from and what are you growing okay paul and kathy susie we're from mayville wisconsin we grow orchards so apples pears plums cherries and uh, berries so blackberries raspberries blueberries, blueberries currants gooseberries Kathy does the garden, so primarily garlic and onions, and then the other regular garden stuff. We're converting over this year the orchard from a monoculture to getting all of the guilds involved. Wow. And then we got chickens this year, meat chickens. Good. I uh, have to get them out of the way before I go off to build a church in Minnesota. Okay, how many chickens? Got uh, 11 today. There were okay. 15 yesterday, but we processed four. All right. And she's got, she's brought scobies to the party. You know you've gone to a cool party when they bring scobies to give away. Did you get them to give away yet? Some of them, yes. There's okay, more. Okay, if anybody needs a scoby, free source right here. Thanks, yep. guys. We'll be over here. And you want to be a sheep. I want to be a sheep, yeah. Okay, bah, bah, fun bah, fact. Bah. <laughs> How's it going? I'm Nate, and this is Leslie. We're from Chattanooga, Tennessee. What? <laughs> I think they win the distance. Yeah. I think you won the distance award here. Yeah. Chattanooga, yeah. Tennessee. What are you doing up here in Illinois? Well, we're up here for work, and so we missed all the meetups in Tennessee. So when we found out on Sunday that there was going to be a meetup here, we said, well, we've got to go. Okay. Thank and you for coming. Yep. And we're not growing anything yet, but we're asking lots of questions, and we're excited Good. about starting the process. Cool. Thank you, guys. Hey! Hello, my <laughs> name is Alec Meyer. I live in Freeport, Illinois. Um, I'm growing a thousand pounds of garlic this year. Wow. Honeybees and just vegetables and orchards and syrup and all that stuff. You're awesome. I think this is the new garlic guy. He yeah. brought to the party garlic. Look at all this garlic. Beautiful garlic. Oh my word. And a jar of garlic powder for us. Yes. He said, I don't know if you have room for this. I said, we're going to make room. Thank you for that, yeah, buddy. Yeah, no problem. Because we can't always carry fresh garlic. We don't know when people are going to feed us figure. and when they're not. But we can carry a jar of garlic powder and just sprinkle it on things. Thanks, right. buddy. Yeah. Good gift. Hi there. I'm Roseanne from Bloomington, Illinois. I am growing container garden for the first time this year. Yes. Um, I'm dealing with Lyme disease like you, Justin, Aww. and you motivated me a great deal to, once I realized you even had it, I was watching your channel, didn't even realize you had it until later on. I go, well, if he Aww. can do it, I can do something. Aww. So all the Lyme warriors out there, keep fighting. And I'm growing potatoes, onions, tomatoes, um, lettuce. I did lettuce from seed. It turned out great. I was so excited. Aww. And I, I've tried things. I tried kale first time because of you guys so I'm really I'm grateful for what you guys are doing thank you that's encouraging thank you hello Hi. Uh, I'm Brittany this is Jade and Francisco and little Francisco we do a potted garden in our Naperville townhouse um, we're growing peppers carrots um, lettuce corn. corn a bunch of herbs so just getting our feet wet and we're hoping to move to Montana and start a homestead eventually. Wow. Why Montana? Cheap land, um, yeah. no restrictions and mountains. or mountains. mountains. Okay. Yes. yes. So. Little Francisco, yes. also known as Mr. Fantastic. Can you say hi? <laughs> I think he's getting shy. Up next, up next. Tell us about yourselves. James and Patricia Tomlin, this is our son Brandon. Um, right now we're in Rockford, Illinois, and we, we are growing 25 chickens in a garden on the way. Cool. Good for you guys. <laughs> Thank you. Locals. Come on down, come on down. You gotta tell us what you're doing. You guys watch the vlog? They'll tell the truth. They'll tell the truth. They'll tell the truth. <laughs> tell us about yourself. So we're the Costas and we're from Newark. And we have a large uh, vegetable garden and we have about 30 laying hens. And we just learned how to move a broody hen in our own little spot to hatch her eggs. And we got a, seven chicks out of 11. Nice. So that was good. Good job. You know, 
They say, you know what they say, don't count your chick before they hatch. There's a reason. <laughs> they don't all make it. Hey, hey. I'm Natalie, I'm from Watertown, Wisconsin, and I'm growing a tomato plant. You're growing a tomato plant? Yep. Did you guys hear that? This is the one I've been talking about. I haven't had a name to this person yet. This is Natalie. She's growing one tomato plant. You, if you've heard me say it once, you've heard me say it a million times, don't, just plant. Even if it's one tomato plant in a pot. Yep. Good job, Natalie. <laughs> She's a legend. Hi, I'm Erica, this is Matthew, and we are growing uh, vegetables, some fruit, herbs, lots of flowers, and you're going to grow some stuff soon too, and uh, we're going to hopefully get some chickens next year. Okay, cool. You're going to help? You're going to help with those chickens? What is your favorite thing to do right now on the farm? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe it's going to be chickens. He just hasn't discovered his favorite thing yet. Hey YouTube, my name is David. I live on the north side of Chicago um, in a three bedroom apartment and I'm growing uh, 25 different perennials, a bunch of different uh, annual crops and I have quail and rabbit and mealworms and I have an aquaponic system. Um, I think that's probably about it. Probably forgetting something. but. Yeah. That's enough to qualify as a superhero. Woo. <laughs> I think we recognize you. <laughs> she, she said, Don't embarrass us. You represent Joe, Hi. the Darcy family. My name's Joe from uh, Northern Illinois, and I'm a suburban backyard farmer. My wife and I, we raise chickens and we grow vegetables. And I just want to say I'm a big fan of Darcy Isabella. <laughs> <laughs> Shameless plug. <laughs> And uh, I guess that's it. Thank okay. you. Okay. Mr. Minimalist right here. No, you got it wrong. Hold on a Oh, second. Mr. Maximus, okay. <laughs> My wife's a minimalist. I'm a maximist. <laughs> what? That was amazing. She Wait. wants to know if you had, an ama you had that I, I speech said, plan. I said I didn't know what I was going to say, so I just, whatever came to my mind, I said. Yep. <laughs> so, now they're going to want more of you in her videos. I don't know about that. <laughs> <laughs> Maximalist versus minimalist. That'd make a good video. Hello, my name is Joe Murray, and although I'm not growing anything, I'm here to learn and have picked up a lot of good concepts from other people. So I hope to have a garden by this time next year. Cool. Good and job, I'm also buddy. a fan of Darcy. Everybody, <laughs> and I guess Darcy's a fan of you. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right, come on through, come on through. Okay. okay. I'm Chad Butler, and my wife and daughters could not be here, Michelle, Grace, and Lauren, but we live in Aurora, Illinois, and we are growing sweet corn, green beans, tomatoes, squash, and peppers. Okay, sweet. I'm Lee Wadlington, uh, here with my wife and six kids. We're from Indianapolis, Indiana. Uh, we're growing some Swiss chard, some mustard greens, tomatoes, bell peppers, some strawberries, and some raspberries that they love to pick each morning. Do you guys eat the strawberries? Yes. Yeah. But what about the Swiss chard? I'm not around this product yet. I don't think oh, it's not up yet. Okay. You're brand new. Brand okay, new. good to start with strawberries. I think you'll enjoy those Swiss chards. Fry it with some eggs, it's so good. All right, guys. Come on down, come on down. Last one. This is the last one, then we're gonna close it out here. Close it out strong, guys. Represent Illinois. David and Ramona Swanson uh, from Belvedere, Illinois. And we're just uh, growing a couple of raised beds with tomatoes, peppers, onions. And we also have some uh, peas. Um, I'm trying some scarlet runner beans this year. Uh, we also have uh, a few blueberry plants and um, herbs, uh, greens we tried uh, this year as well. And uh, that's about it. Okay. Good going. job, guys. Thank you. Good job, me. Illinois. I think Lincoln would be very proud. I'm always encouraged. Traveling. This is our favorite part, meeting everybody. Now we see these people in the camera. We're talking to you. It feel, you guys feel like you're with us, but we always, we also feel like you're 
with us. Good night.